it's time for a brand new adventure with Drew Pendus and his Mighty Pen Ultimate. In today's story, Drew and his friends are dressed to thrill. Awesome! Things were getting kind of fun and spooky at Cool School. Everybody was hanging up decorations and carving pumpkins. And most importantly, we got ready for the costume contest. Ooh, let's do something as a group! We've totally got to win this year! What should we do? Let's not be monsters! I don't want to be scared! What if you're the monster, Robbie? Then you won't be scared of any of us. As long as I don't look in a mirror, that could work. You can be Frankenstein's monster. I'll be Dr. Frankenstein. Nikki, you can be Igor. I'll be the Bride of Frankenstein. Let's get started drawing and painting these costumes. Let's do it. Meanwhile, Cruel School was also getting ready. Although they always, always look kind of spooky. I want us to do vampire costumes. I think we should be werewolves. No, we should be zombies. What about unicorns? They're so pretty. The more time we spend arguing, the less time we have to make these costumes. Ugh, as much as I hate to say it, Ray is right. We need to just pick one. Fine, we could be vampires, but only if I get to I be- I get to be Dracula, Tibbs. I called it. No fair. Too bad. I'll be Dracula, and you can all be my vampire bat sidekicks. Can Dracula have a unicorn sidekick too? No unicorns, Timmy. Wait, Ella, you need one more thing. Perfect! And now it's time for our monster. Nice job! How do I look? Great, want me to draw a mirror? No, 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 I trust you. Now it's time to work on our act. Do you guys know how to sing Putting on the Ritz? Meanwhile, the Cruel School gang was getting dressed in their costumes, but <sighs> something wasn't right with Ray. Are you okay, Ray? You seem tired. I'm fine. Somebody help me put on my cape. I can barely move my arms with these wings tied to them. It's driving me batty. This was not a good idea. Finally, it was the night of the big costume party. Dean Mean, are you supposed to be a kitty cat? No, I'm a lion. The costume shop was sold out of manes and fangs, okay? All right, everyone, settle down. It's time to start the show. First up, the kindergartners. Oh. Ah, I can't help it. They're too cute. I have to give them a nine out of 10. I told you guys we should have been unicorns. So the costume contest continued. There were mummies and wizards. And nobody was quite sure what Frankie was dressed as. But then it was time for Drew and his friends. Welcome to my lab. I'll just draw some switches. Igor, flip the switch. It's alive! Ah, Frankenstein! Actually, Frankenstein was the name of the doctor, not the monster. Oh, I didn't know that. Happy, Happy Halloween! Halloween! Great special effects. Excellent craftsmanship. Actually, a little scary. 10 out of 10. Great job, guys. Let's take a selfie. Look how great we look. Yeah, I didn't want to see myself. I'm a monster. Ah! And now it's time for Ray and friends from Cruel School. This better be good. I thought we were just making ghost sounds. This is terrible. Where's your Dracula? Where's Ray? I don't know. He just disappeared. Ugh, just keep flapping those wings. Sorry, kids. You're missing your star. That means the winner is... Drew and Friends from Cool School. Aw, thanks, everybody. Sorry if anyone got scared, especially me. What happened out there? Ray disappeared right before the show. So lame. Grr, when I find him, he's getting detention for the rest of the year. Scratch that, the rest of every year. Hey guys, is Ray all right? Who cares? We lost because of him. He's still your friend. You should be worried if he's missing. Whatever, I'm going home to eat candy and feel better. 
Well, I want to make sure he's okay. I'm gonna look for him. Ray, are you around here? Hmm. Ray, wake up! <gasps> Where am I? You fell asleep in this broom closet. You missed the whole costume contest. Oh man, I'm just so tired. I haven't been sleeping all week. I've been too scared. Why? What are you scared of? I can't tell you. You'll make fun of me. How about this? I'll tell you something that I'm scared of, and you can tell me what you're scared of. We'll say it at the same time. Deal? Okay. One, two, three. There's a monster orange in Orange juice. Room. Wait, what? You're afraid of orange juice? I hate the pulp. It just tastes so weird. But hold on. You think there's a monster in your room? Yeah. Every night when I'm trying to fall asleep, I start hearing footsteps. It's so scary. I haven't slept in days. Okay, I have an idea. I'll come over to your house for a sleepover tonight. If there's a monster in your room, we'll catch it. Really? You would help me? Sure, let's catch that monster. <clears throat> let's see what happens next. Okay, Drew, we're almost there. Now don't get into any trouble. That Ray Blank can be a bad influence. Don't worry, Mom. We're just gonna play some games, watch some TV. We are definitely not trying to capture a monster in the middle of the night. What? Nothing. Thanks for letting my friend Drew have a sleepover tonight. Of course, Ray. Now remember that Drew Pendus can be a good influence, so don't learn anything nice from him. You're supposed to be a bad guy. Don't worry, I promise I won't learn to be nice. He's here! Hi, Mrs. Pendus. Hi, Ray, hope you boys have fun tonight. Ew, Mom, you're embarrassing me. That's part of my job. Now I'll pick you up tomorrow. I love you. Wow, Ray, your house is pretty cool. Bad guys don't have houses, we have lairs. Nice to meet you, Mr. Blank. Please, call me Mel. Dinner time, everyone. Uh-oh, since you're evil, do you eat gross things for dinner? I don't want to eat bugs. Here you go, Drew. Oh, spaghetti. That's good. Yep, I stole it from a kid in the park. Did he cry? Sure did. <laughs> Come on, Drew. Let's eat up so we can catch that monster. What? Nothing. Okay, Ray, tell me exactly what's been going on. I always like to have a glass of milk next to my bed before I go to sleep. But every night, after the lights go out, I hear footsteps, so I hide under the covers. Then when I wake up in the morning, the glass of milk is empty. It's a monster, I just know it. Hmm, that's weird. But this time, we'll be ready. Looks like we're out of milk. Oh well, this will have to do. Ah, orange juice! Get that away from me! Oh yeah, I forgot, you're afraid of orange juice. The pulp just tastes so weird, all right? Well, too bad, we're both facing our fears tonight. Let's go. Okay, fine, let's be brave. Drew took out his mighty penultimate and turned into the stupendous Drupendous. Here's the plan, I'll draw a decoy in your bed. Then we'll hide behind that jug and see what happens. Is that what you think I look like? It doesn't have to look perfect. Let's get this under your covers. Then turn off the lights. And now we'll keep watch. You've really got to clean your room, Ray. Shh. Any minute now, I promise. Ray, it's been a while. Are you sure something's going to happen? Look, the closet door. A monster! I told you! Okay, you've got this. Time for a big scare. But first, a glass of milk. <coughs> Orange juice with pulp? Ah! Now! Gotcha! Ah! I'm scared! Wait, you're scared? But you're a monster! I know, but I'm not scary enough. Yeah, you do look kind of cute. Cute? Oh no, I'm a failure. What do you mean? 
I'm just a kid in monster school. I've got to scare a certain number of people to earn my stripes. You know, because monsters with stripes are always scarier. Have you been drinking my milk every night? Yeah, my mom says that milk makes you big and strong. I'm tiny and cuddly, so I thought some milk would help. Listen to my roar. Roar! See? Not scary at all. So you're just a kid like us? Doing well in school is tough. I get it. And you just want to grow up. Here, I'll draw some milk for you. Gee, thanks. Now I just need to find somebody to scare so I can get a good grade. If I fail another scaring test, I could get detention. You get detention too? I know what that's like. Okay, I've got somebody who could really use a good scare. Oh, Mama, I hope you're proud of me. I'm trying so hard to be a good dean, and I just want Miss Booksy to respect me. Here goes nothing. Ah, monster! Yes, earn my stripes. It worked. More of the story, kids. Don't be scared of monsters. They probably just want some milk. Oh, and when it comes to orange juice, pulp isn't so bad. It's really not. 